Welcome back to Paradise TV. We are in one of the high-end art galleries at Miramar Design Center, and we are surrounded by so many creative pieces of contemporary art that comes from all over the world. It's really cool in here. And recently, I got to meet a local artist of a different kind. She gets her inspiration from being outside. You can find her sitting on the dock of a bay, but she is not wasting time. Ooh, just sitting on the dock of the bay. This is Tin City, a place Jen Norqual is lucky enough to call her office. It's been nine and a half years of uh, creating dock scenes on the dock. I make like three-dimensional docks out of crab traps and driftwood and uh, personalize them for people. Whether it's your favorite vacation hangout, a family business, or your hometown, Jen is creating a way to display a lifetime of memories. We call it the river of life, like the different docks you've tied up to along the river of life. I'm just trying to capture everyone's life or their favorite memories, whatever makes you happy every time you look at the piece. Each dock scene is created with little pieces of paradise found right here in Florida, things like driftwood. We'll uh, hit the beaches and beach comb, of course, and then we love to take the boat and head south to Cape Romano, and that's where it's just piled up in mounds. And lobster traps. I go down to Key Largo and get old lobster traps, and the more barnacles, the better is kind of the idea with those. Once all the materials are collected, that's when the fun work begins, and I, of course, had to put my creative side to the test. All right, Carly, so the first thing we'll do is pick out our front piece for the dock. Once we have our driftwood centerpiece, it's time to nail it to the lobster trap. That serves as its backbone. What am I doing? Just push it all the way down in the back and then pull the trigger. There you go. So do that? Yep. Woo! You got it. All right. Then it's time to sand the little houses, something I found much easier than using the jigsaw. It's harder to do than you think. It is. Do you want oh, to just really? sand it off? Yeah, I like okay. the sander The better. sander's fun, yeah. So after a lot of nailing, sanding, sawing, and my favorite part, a little painting, the official dock of Paradise TV is done. It looks beautiful. Yes. I love you did a great it. Job. Yes, it's cute. Well, <laughs> what little I did. If you look around, you'll actually see a lot of docks by Jin hanging in local restaurants and even in a lot of the local retailers as well. Those are really cool. Nice job mm -hmm. of making Thank that dock, you. by the way. <laughs> it's so hard not to be inspired when surrounded by so many beautiful beaches mm -hmm. in Naples. Speaking of, let's check out tonight's Beach of the Week. Tonight, we are heading to a well-kept secret in Naples, Clam Pass Beach. Here beachgoers can choose to catch a free tram ride to the beach or take the scenic walk down the mangrove covered boardwalk. Once you're at the beach, there is almost a mile of soft white sand waiting. The waters are calm and perfect for kayaking and fishing. Oh, I love it. It seems very secluded and private, so that's why I love it. <laughs> but it's very clean. The water's nice and calm. It's gorgeous. And don't worry about bringing a chair or umbrella to Clam Pass Beach because all the amenities you might need are available for rental. What is your favorite local beach? We'd love to check it out. Send us an email or send us a message on our Facebook page and let us know.